Learning Hub is a great place to learn about various SAP topics, mostly for free. But it can be confusing sometimes to understand the differences between the free and the paid version of the SAP Learning Hub. In this video, I'm going to talk about the differences in detail and also how you can use this website to learn about various SAP topics. If you are new here, my name is Arun and I make videos about SAP topics. Please subscribe to the channel to keep up to date. Now let's get into the topic. Firstly, what is SAP Learning Hub? SAP Learning Hub is a comprehensive online learning platform that is provided by SAP. It offers a wide range of training materials and resources designed to help individuals learn about SAP software and solutions. It contains learning journeys, courses, certifications, live sessions, and offers hands-on practice using trial systems. Learning journeys are free to learn. They are represented using the green color. Courses will cost you money and you will be redirected to the SAP training and certification website to purchase the course. The price for the course depends on the type of course you have chosen. Courses are represented using the color pink. Then certifications will also cost you money. There are two ways through which you can purchase SAP certification exams. The first one is by purchasing through the SAP training and certification shop. For one certification attempt, it will cost you 217 US dollars or you can purchase a six certification attempt for 543 US dollars. The other way to purchase the certifications is through the SAP Learning Hub subscription. SAP Learning Hub subscription will cost you 1,368 US dollars per year and it will give you four certification attempts per year. You will also be able to join some of the live sessions that are available only for the subscription users. Now, let me show you how this all works. Say for example, I'm interested in learning about SAP s Private Cloud Edition. I can start learning about the different modules or capabilities that are available in the s Private Cloud Edition. Let me choose Finance and the submodule Financial Accounting. And I can see all the learning journeys, courses and certifications that are relevant to the topic that I have chosen. Now remember, the learning journeys are free to consume. Courses will cost you depending on the type of course and the certifications will also cost you depending on which method you choose to pursue as discussed previously. I will choose the learning journey implementing SAP s Cloud Private Edition. It shows that there are 12 units available in this learning journey and it will take approximately 11 hours to complete it. It is free to consume and it will also lead to a certification, which means once you complete this learning journey, you can attempt to take the certification exam and if you pass the exam, you can get certified. And it gives you some high level details about the course, like learning objectives, the required type of experience, and then are there any prerequisites to do this course, which means you should have completed any other learning journeys before attempting to learn this particular one. Then when you scroll down, you can see the units and the contents of the units. Then finally, you can attempt to take the certified exam. This is how the learning journey works. If I go back and select a course, it will take me to the SAP training and certification website and I can enroll on the courses that I like to enroll on. SAP used to provide a free learning website called OpenSAP, which has now also been incorporated into the SAP Learning Hub. SAP Learning Hub is a great place to learn and upskill yourself in the SAP space and you can do the learning part mostly for free. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and share it with your friends who might also benefit from the content. Thank you.